Okay. My name is uh, Rutola Williams. I am the secretary of the Catholic Lawyers at Our Lady of Perpetual Help in Victoria Island, Lagos, Nigeria. The church uh, rose, used to be, sorry, the church used to be the papal uh, nuncio and subsequently um, it became Our Lady of Perpetual Help. At Our Lady of Perpetual Help, which is the church where I attend, our parish priest was very concerned that we should have an active organization of Catholic lawyers. So um, he, asked, he asked me to try and institute the organization. In doing so, I met Mr. Chukuma Ziala, who was the secretary of the national body. And we liaised with them. And during the course of the work, we found out that we were actually going to be doing a lot of practical aspects of the law, which included, amongst other things, social justice and legal education. So last year, we organized a seminar on Islamic banking. And this year, we were asked by Monsignor Pascal to look into the issues which were being addressed at the National Assembly which was uh, namely that we needed to draft a bill on the dignity of the human person in line with Catholic do doctrine. We were to look at a constitutional review on abortion and to discuss the need for and to debate a bill to um, establish Nigerian assisted artificial reproduction. There are other, many, many other issues but the main work of the uh, Catholic lawyers um, on these issues will be to debate them and to make recommendations. And in this uh, scenario, we also support the Justice and Peace Development Commission. And uh, they are organized, we work with them, and we um, are like the, the practical hands of the, of the commission. At, uh, at parish level, uh, this means we're the soldier ants on the ground. Um, at uh, the national level, uh, it means that we are involved in uh, lobbying the National Assembly through the Nigerian Bar Association and working with other associations. So I hope that you now have a better understanding of the way the Catholic Lawyers works. Thank you. My name is Tamara Ebedi, and I'm a lawyer by profession. I'm a parishioner at the Our Lady of Perpetual Help, Victoria Island, Lagos in Nigeria. And um, I'm also the treasurer of the Catholic Lawyers Association, but then that is for the parish itself. And we were actually called up together by the parish priest, uh, Father Henry Tunde, Omonisaye, CMF, and he called, he actually made an announcement and said, due to the way the society is, and the country, as a community and a parish, we need to actually do something. And something very peculiar about our parishes is mostly our professionals. So how can as professionals make a difference? And then we have the Catechism Association formed. Um, I'll give a summary of what we've done so far since last year when we were inaugurated. Um, we actually go straight to the mountain most of the time. So we, as, as uh, one of my colleagues has said, we are like the soldiers. We are the active part. We try to, we support both the justice and um, peace societies as well as any other um, um, society, just like St. Vita the Paul. We have many of them who come to us with various cases. Some, like just in peace, is with cases of uh, those in court, or also those with our parishioners themselves. Now what we do is we take it up and we handle it free of charge. What we now do as well is we also target sensitive issues in the country. We target issues which actually has a religious tone, 
or acting as a moral and hit on our values as a country and on our religion. And hence, when there was the um, introduction of the Islamic banking, we now set up, um, we had a seminar with all professionals where we actually spoke about it and our community was sent over to the government because it actually sensitized the people on what it was, but morally, religiously, and its effect on the country. And um, so based on that, we also have meetings to also deepen our faith as lawyers and how we can actually, in our profession, actually show our faith down in our profession and in our family life as well. Finally, we're trying to go beyond it and we're trying to get a newsletter which will actually um, bring down in paper and which we spread all around the country and to various parishes the issues based on the national level and in every parish and also in the country, educating the people and showing them what we can do and where there's actually succor and there's actually help. So um, that hopefully is our project for 2013 with the help of our priest and every other person and um, we all hope to actually achieve that. Thank you very much.